Hi guys, Jai Shri Mahal. In previous video, we have discussed till question number 41. Now it is question number 42. In a question C, density of water at the surface is rho naught and at point much below the surface is rho. Okay. Neglecting the variation in gravitational acceleration g and assuming a constant value of bulk modulus k, the depth h at the point from the p surface is what? Here it is a p surface and the surface density is rho naught and somewhere below the depth h it is rho. Now we have to find out this h. Now first we, we know that the formula of bulk modulus is rho del t by del rho. So rho is the initial rho. Change in the pressure is what? Uh, final pressure rho dh minus rho naught. This one rho naught d. Here h is what? Zero. Upon change in the density rho minus final density minus initial density. This is uh, this is uh, this is, uh, final density minus initial density that is rho naught. K equals to what? Rho naught into rho g h upon so h is what? K by g into rho minus rho naught upon rho rho naught. So H can be simplified as K by G 1 by rho naught minus 1 by rho. So this is the final expression. So the answer will be this K by G 1 upon rho naught minus 1 upon rho. Okay. Question 43. Pseudo plastic is a fluid for which dynamic viscosity decreases as the rate of rate of shear increases yes it is correct it is dynamic viscosity is this and shear is this one so it is definitely correct so a is also a is correct no newton's law is not does not hold good increases no wrong it is increases yes it is also wrong so a will be the answer Okay, 44th question. If an angle of contact of a drop of liquid is active, what the wetting fluid? This, like this. This is a cave surface for water, for wetting fluid. Now, this is active. It happens in case of liquid. Uh, in case of water, here adhesion force is more than the cohesion force. So A will be the answer. Okay. Now for just opposite happens in case of murky. On wet upward surface is seen and the angle is optic that is equal to 130 degrees. It is not acute, it is obtuse. In case of mercury, okay. That is theta. So, A will be the right answer. A will be the right answer. Uh, 45. With the increase in pressure, the bulk modulus of elasticity, bulk modulus of elasticity, bulk modulus is what? Rho dt by d rho. With the increase in pressure, definitely it will increase. So B will be the right answer. 46. Where is the following? Capillarity, surface tension, vapor pressure, cavitation, viscosity, shear force. This question is repeated for the second time. 413. In 2011, previously it was asked in 2000. And one more time it was asked. Three times the same question was asked. That is the reason why we need to solve previous year questions. Newton's law of viscosity relates. 
here deformation and shear stress. Tau is equal to mu del u by del y. This is the shear deformation and this is the shear stress. Okay, eight. In an experiment to determine the rheological behavior of material, the observed relation between shear stress tau and the rate of shear strength is this one. So there is a constant, okay? Constant and it is 0.5. I have told you under root y equal to under root x. So it is like this. Yes, that will be hectotropic. But here it is like वो होता है सुडो प्लास्टिक आज मैंने प्रीवियस वीडियो में गलती से सुडो हिस्टोट्रोपी बोल दिया था आप देख लेना तो याद नहीं है नहीं बोला ये होगा सुडो प्लास्टिक ये होगा हिस्टोट्रोपी और ये होगा टाउन नॉट तो आंसर इज बी ये मैं शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स में कवर करूंगा जितने भी टाइप के मटेरियल है जितने भी टाइप के फ्लूइड है ओपन लाइन ये Okay, make the list one with list two and select the correct answer. Go mm -hmm. oh, here, yeah, cylinder discometer. So, we have types of discometer. Go, we have the principle of which we have to match. So, first, let's take a note. You should read all type of discometer. So, you should make some short note. Yeah, that is question. So, let me tell you. Ah, this is the first one. Go here, discometer. दो सिलेंडर रहता है जैसा भीतर रहता है और उसमें एक मोटर जुड़ी हुई होती है इसको रोटेट करवाते तो वो विस्कोसिटी मेजर करता है तो और फाइंड आउट हो जाता है उसको विस्कोसिटी आप मेजर करते हैं बाकी जो पैरामीटर है ऑल द पैरामीटर्स वी हैव गिवन डेंसिटी एंड ऑल डायमीटर ऑफ दिस बीकर एंड डायमीटर ऑफ दिस रॉड सो यू कैन वी कैन गेट द विस्कोसिटी विस्कोसिटी ऑफ विस्कोसिटी ऑफ विद द हेल्प ऑफ को एक जैसे सिलेंडर विस्पोल लेता है। तो the phenomena which is used is what you dead u by del y plus two shear stress that is Newton's law is possible। ठीक। ये कट भी हो गया। So B और D can be the answer। Now directly see D falling shear विस्पोल लेता है। Shear is falling in the liquid. So in that we will find out the drag force that is equal to 6 pi nRB. Everybody knows. So from this, 6 pi n, 6 pi mu RB or 6 pi nRB. So from this we can find out this possibility. So, so which law is this? Stoke law. So B ka kya ho jayega? Q ho jayega. You get Q. अच्छा ये आप जब सी बोल्ड विस्फोटमीटर के बारे में पढ़ेंगे तो आपको पता चलेगा कि ये डेट इज़ अलसो कॉल्ड ई प्लस विस्फोटमीटर तो दिस विल बी द डी विल बी द आंसर ओके एंड इन द कैपिलरिटी विस्फोटमीटर द प्रिंसिपल यूज़ दिस आईगन पॉसिबिलिस इक्वेशन तो यू सी द नोट रीड ऑल टाइप ऑफ विस्फो I just am reading a non-Newtonian fluid. The shear stress at any point is not linear. Function of normal distance from the surface. Yes, it is correct. Now, the behavior usually arises because of the fluid molecules are very large, like polymer supporting. Ah, uh, no, non-linearity does not arises because of the size of the molecule. इसमें जो है साइज का मॉलिक्यूल के साइज का कोई लेना देना नहीं, ठीक है? जो दो मॉलिक्यूल्स हैं उसके बीच में जो कोहेजी फोर्स है वो डिसाइड करेगा कि विस्कोसिटी कितनी है कोहेजी फोर्स बिटवीन द टू मॉलिक्यूल्स कॉजेस विस्कोसिटी सो इट इज नॉट करेक्ट सो सी विल बी द आंसर मर्करी लेवल इनसाइड द ट्यूब शेल राइज अबोव द लेवल ऑफ मर्करी इन गलत इट विल फॉल सो डी विल बी द आंसर एंड वाटर लेवल विल राइज because water is non-wetting uh, wetting fluid, it is non-wetting fluid. Cohesive force is more in mercury, that is why it is it fall down. Cohesive uh, adhesive force is more in water, cohesive force is less than adhesive force. That's why that is the reason why water will rise. In previous both the previous videos have 
tooling the vapor pressure is the characteristic fluid property involved in the phenomena of agitation pressure inside a soap bubble nikalna hai that is the uh, diameter 50 mm pressure uh, ये प्रेशर दिया हुआ है एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर दिया हुआ अबोव एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर मतलब गैस प्रेशर दिया हुआ है एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर से ऊपर कितना प्रेशर इसका मतलब दिस इज एब्सोल्यूट पी एब्सोल्यूट इक्वल टू पी गैस प्लस पी एटीएम सो द प्रेशर अबोव द एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर इज दिस वन सो 25 विल बी गैस प्रेशर नाउ वी नीड टू फाइंड आउट सरफेस टेंशन सो डेल्टा पी प्रेशर इज व्हाट 25 and for soap bubble 8 sigma by b b is what 0.05 25 into 5 upon 180a so this will be equal to 0.166 1.6 now statement 1 a small insect can sit on the free surface of the liquid even uh, liquid though insect density is higher even if the density of insect is higher than the water because of the surface tension it can it can sit on the water so it is correct because liquid have viscosity no yes liquid have viscosity but uh, it is correct but reason is not correct explanation of the question so D will be done. Which of the following fluid exhibits a certain shear stress at zero shear strain, followed by a straight line relationship between the shear Newtonian fluid straight line relationship? He gets fifty nine A. Sorry, sorry. Certain shear stress. So oh, we need to read the question carefully. It is a certain shear stress at Zero shear strain and then it is increasing. So that is a uh, ideal plastic or Bingham plastic. So B will be the answer. Yes, it is B will be the answer. Okay. For Newtonian fluid at zero deformation, it is shear stress is zero. And for Bingham plastic, it is it is having some value. Then it is increasing above that. If angle of contact of the drop of liquid is acute, then it is then adhesion force is more than the cohesion. Okay. So our fluid mechanics का पहला chapter खत्म हो चुका है. Ah, next chapter will be pressure measuring devices. Till then, revise all these questions or comment box में please comment कीजिएगा. और अगर पहली बार आप video देख रहे हैं तो please subscribe जरूर कीजिए. और अच्छा लग रहा है तो बिल्कुल लाइक जरूर कीजिएगा थोड़ा सा साउंड का इशू है थोड़े दिन में वो रिजॉल्व हो जाएगा मैं फिलहाल में सिर्फ कंटेंट डिलीवरी पे ध्यान दे रहा हूँ आई एम ट्राइंग टू एक्सप्लेन ईच एंड एवरी क्वेश्चन एंड ईच एंड एवरी रिपीटेड कंसेप्ट ईच एंड मेनी टाइम्स क्वेश्चन के आंसर बताने का कोई फायदा नहीं है बेटर है कि एक क्वेश्चन से मैं ज्यादा से ज्यादा कंसेप्ट रिलेट कर सकूँ ताकि उससे रिलेटेड जो भी क्वेश्चन बन रहे हैं वो भी आप अटेम्प कर पाए और अपना फीडबैक आप जरूर दीजिए थैंक यू सो मच जय श्री महाकाल